All right, how are you doing today? Today we're gonna to be talking about UJAM's Mellow Virtual Upright Bassist, a really cool plugin. Lately I've been messing around with a lot of their other plugins, guitarists, drummers, beat makers, their synthesizer, and a lot of other cool stuff. Um, in this video, I'm gonna go over a demonstration of how the plugin actually works, some of the different things. There's over 13,000, or 1,300 patterns rather, not 13,000. Um, there's a bunch of uh, patterns that you can play that you can MIDI drag and drop into your DAW as well. I'm gonna be playing it with the virtual guitar Silk and the drummer Deep that they, that they have as well. And also the beat maker called Dope. I have a couple different demos of playing the drums with that. So pretty cool stuff. Also, please do check out my channel. I have hundreds of other videos in my back catalog. A bunch of really cool stuff about music production, VST plugins, free plugins, different songwriting courses and music production courses that I've taken. There'll be links in the video description below for all that stuff as well. There is a 30 day trial for this plugin too. And there will be a link in the video description below for that. Check that out. All right, cool. So please do subscribe to the channel, hit the notification bell to be notified of new videos coming out. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments below as well. Let's get into this. So this is the plugin here. We have a couple of different things to go over real quick and then we'll play some sounds. We have the common phrases, we have style phrases, and then we have the play range. Um, these are all laid out on your keyboard, C1, C2, C3, and so on and so forth. Uh, and then we have two different kind of presets up here. We have the settings for this, and this is gonna change the style phrasing and the bass sound based on all these controls down here bass, the mic, the room, and everything. We'll go over that in a second. So we have different uh, styles here of music as well. Alternative, blues and rock, country, funk and soul, hip hop, jazz, Latin pop, and then just soul. And then we have presets here as well that go with the style phrases. Now the common phrases are gonna stay the same regardless of where you're at because these are just common phrases. And then we have style phrases that are selected by these different styles here. And then we, they will change with these presets as well. But you can just change them if you want to. If you have a sound that you like, you can go through some styles. And of course, you can tweak the sound as well. And then you play your chords up here. Pretty simple. Uh, if you just hit a C, for example, it's going to play a C chord. Well, the C line, I guess. Or you can play the C as a C or C minor, but the bass line's kind of similar because it's all C on this case. So we have C sus4, C5, C sus2, that's actually a D7. There's your C sus2. So a couple different things with the chords up there, and that is triggering these style phrases down here. We also have fills as well. So we can change the pattern here, for example. And then we could use these key switches to change the patterns up. Stop button as well, and then fills. And then fills as well. So pretty cool. Um, we have intro settings and all kinds of stuff like that. And then we have an instrument version of it as well. So if you just want to play on a keyboard as a regular bass instrument. Then we have key switches as well for slides and such. Dead notes. So yeah, pretty cool. Um, let's go back to the player. Oh, we also have the bends here and uh, vibrato if you want to use your pitch bends or your uh, modulation keys on your keyboard or you can just do it here. You get the nice vibrato. Pitch bend. 
so yeah pretty cool that's the instrument version of it but let's get back to the player here position this is going to be the neck and bridge uh basically where your your fingers are on the bass so you can change the sound of that and then we have the characteristic of the bass We've got soft deep natural hard and then tight and we'll go through some of these different sounds and then where the mics are uh present round or not where they are but the different kinds of mics and stuff like that and we have the room here as well got a lot more room in here we have a d drop we have an octaver and then we have the finisher which is not on this one this is like some additional effects that go after everything here some really cool effects for like uh, space grinder there is kind of delayed this is the amount that you get there old radio So, and there's some spring reverb and some other stuff down here, punch and crunch. So anyways, that's kind of a quick overlay. We have EQ, then compressor as well. And then we have micro timing. We have half speed, regular speed, double speed. Then we have a fill, push and pull. You could swing it a little bit. Then we have the timing, a little tighter, a little looser, and so on and so forth. All right, so I created a little track here using some of the other UJM plugins. I got the drummer Deep playing, and I have the uh, Silk, which is the nylon string guitar. So I just made a really quick uh, song here. And what I did is I took the chords, and so the bass part, just so that this real quick, show you this. These are just the chords playing up in the upper register of over here. And then we're gonna trigger these different patterns. For example, let's do this. So as you can see, the chords are playing up there, and then I can switch the phrases over here. So just play the song real quick, and we'll just go through some different sounds of the bass, see what happens. It's a pretty cool little groove there. And then we'll go through some of the factory presets. Right now we're on alternative. And we'll just scroll through. Again, this will change the sounds of the bass up here and the style presets as well. So this will change everything pretty much. As you can see right there, I just changed the settings down here. That one has the space grinder on it. That's cool for certain things. Um, not really good for this one, but let's just go through the next one then. Another thing to note is too that with the common phrases and the style phrases they get they start off simple and they get more complicated as you go up this, uh, the notes here so if i do this this is just a very common phrase let's actually mute the drums here so you can hear the bass a little better and as you move up the keyboard So they get a little more complicated. And same thing with the style phrases. Of course, that one's kind of similar based on the style. Also, these little things here, these are MIDI. So you can drag the MIDI data into your DAW as well. Right now, I'm just kind of using the triggering of the with the chords and the style phrases. Let's move on to another preset here.
some out of control stuff there too. That's the brick crusher. You could change that. <laughs> So as you can see, there's a lot of really cool sounds here. Let's try some different beats. So I added in this other plugin called Dope Beatmaker by UGM as well. They sell a bundle of this with the dope, uh, the upright bass, and silk. So I just threw these together real quick, see what we could come up with here. I just threw a beat down real quick. Get that out of the way. Back to the bass. We'll try out some of the hip hop sounds here. And just made this little chord progression, a couple minor chords, one may I think major chord. I don't forget what I put down, but see what it sounds like. Pretty cool. Switch the bass up here. Pretty cool. Let's meet that guitar real quick here. Change the pattern on that. These things all kind of work together, so that's really cool. So this is silk. That's a little off rhythm there. All right, so pretty cool. I could just go on and play with this for a long time. They come up with some really cool stuff. Uh, I didn't even touch on the blues and country, but maybe I'll do that in a video for that. Yeah, so cool. All right, so that is all for now. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comments below. I will talk to you soon.